How to block spam in AOL mail. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. This is your solution guide Bimal. In today's guide video, I will show you the way on how you can actually block spam emails on the AOL mail app. But before we get started with the video, if you are new to our channel, do make sure to leave a like and hit the subscribe button without any further ado or delay. Let's get started with today's video. Now, first things first, simply make sure that you have either downloaded or updated the AOL mail app to the latest version. You can do this by heading over to your app store in the search box tapping in AOL mail and go ahead and simply either download or update the app. Once you've updated the AOL mail app, I want you to go over and then simply open it up. The next thing you want to make sure is that you are logged into your account and after you are logged in, then you can see this is how it's going to look like. By default, it will take you to the browser web interface. So what you have to do is tap on this inbox button, which you see at the bottom left corner. Once you go to the inbox tab, you'll see all the sorts of various options. Now all you have to do is a simple long press on the mails that you want to mark as spam. And once you do that, you'll find a little three dots at the bottom right corner or you can tap on this move button as well. When you tap on move, you have to select the option called spam over here. Or else what you can do is you can simply tap on the three dots and just tap on the option called spam. And what this does is that in the future, if you receive any type of similar emails, AOL is going to mark them as spam. But this is it. This is how you can go around Working out on how you can block the spam emails on AOL mail, there really isn't any other option. This is simply how it works. We hope the video was really helpful and if it did help you, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. If you have got any more questions, queries or doubts, then simply also make sure to leave them down in the comment section. Thank you very much for watching till the end of this tutorial and see you soon in our next video.